We're back. Four months ago, we came across the coolest oddities museum in Savannah, Georgia. Grayface Museum. Now we're heading back. We'll see what else is new on site. I assure you, we're open. It's the gateway to hell. Welcome aboard, Satan. Oh my. Clementine. The five legged cow. Yeah. Holy cow. Yeah. Okay, be quiet. Okay, be quiet. So then in the 50s, he ended up doing the time Homer Tate's fish girl. It looks like you. Elderly woman doll recovered from Ophelia Baker's Madame Tree's house. Wolf boy. This is one of our favorite things here. The Fiji mermaid. And shrunken heads. We should own stock in Fiji mermaids. Yeah. There's not a place that we go that they don't have them. <laughs> Step right up and see the crocodile boy. Vertically challenged people. A circus display, P.T. Barnum, Buffalo Bill. We went to a circus museum in Sarasota recently. You can check out that video up here. Billy Bird. The Vicious Vipers. That is so cool. Circus scrapbooks. All kinds of like freak showy type stuff. The smallest perfect man on earth is looking for a wife. And he wants to walk you home. Crazy. More circus freak show carnival artwork. Mark Pearson. Crazy there with settings by itself all of a sudden. Maybe there's something a little spooky here. It's an odd fellow skeleton. On top of a children's display coffin. It's an odd fellow skull from 1800s. Pig man! And all the free pinball you want. Gallery of freaks. Mary has a friend. Haunted dolls. Where they talk talk. Since putting this doll in the shop whenever someone was working we'd walk by, they'd occasionally hear their name whispered when no one was around. It's a black magic talking board from the 60s. photograph that keeps reappearing over and over again the family
Поэтому не вот. So after figure out the last two rows, this camera kept zooming in and out. The battery would shut off, then go back on. So really weird stuff happening. And I've never had problems with this camera before. What's wrong? Oh, all the cult stuff is up here. And this was all cloud stuff previously. Very cool. I like the changes. Charles Manson stuff. Pair of his pants. Elvon Hubbard. You're telling me that Dianetics is a cult? No way! Fun fact, I read this book when I was about 18 or so, and I was like, what's this all about? And, uh... If there's something in there to get, I'm not getting it. It's Heaven's Gate. The last time that we were here, it made me go back home and look up the type of Nikes that were used. Mm -hmm. I really killed them That our father's kingdom has lots of reps. So my main camera shut off, and now look at the iPhone. It's going crazy. What is going on here? In any event, this VCR belonged to Heaven's Gate. And those are some of the VHS tapes. Jim Jones sunglasses. Oh, it is going crazy in like my camera screen anyway. Jim Jones sunglasses. And it's flavored. David Koresh and the Branch Davidians. That feels like it was just yesterday. Oh, it is crazy. Huh. T-shirts that were sold at the complex. Letters from Charles Manson. It's a human spine from Anton LaVey's collection. It's crazy. Hmm. It's the Necronomicon. David Berkowitz. San Quentin Prison gift shop pieces. That was found in the Gacy house. Gacy's mugshot. So, I have so he did this one. Oh. pictures were drawn for Gacy by somebody from Disney. And they have a letter from an individual here. It's his friend. And they're interested in the fact of Gacy's Pogo, the clown character. So, hence Mickey and Donald and Pogo Sticks, one of Gacy's victims. <laughs> Gacy's last check. There you go. Interesting with his love of Disney characters. Patches the clown. Monsters. They could buy a monster. Jerry Gacy's license plates. Gacy hid information in his landmark pieces, and this is one of them. And you can see a set of stars. It's making its crosses, which may indicate just how many victims he actually had beyond what we know about. Gacy's death certificate. Newspapers heralding the death of Gacy. And Gacy's logbook. No last entry. I'm talking about the clown. Creepy. Look at these guys. There are a lot of goodies for sale here. Really crazy oddities. Look at that. I'm not quite sure where I would put that in my house. This kind of looks like Kyle Gas. 
don't get kind of interested in some clowns. Well, I don't remember Cabbage Patch Kids looking like that. Look at the bleeding clothes. You fill my head with very naughty thoughts. Oh, you can paint your own serial killer artwork. Holy cow, it's the Runaways live in Japan. Man down, man down. All right, so we wrap with Grave Face Museum. It's right down below. Um, I like the changes. It's a little bit more open, but it is more crowded than the last time that we were here for sure. Um, but I did like the circus presentation the way it was previously. Just got to be honest. Yeah. It was very small, but it was very well done. Yeah. Now there is a lot of focus and wide open on the cults and serial killers and stuff like that. Yeah. So the really weird thing, and I've never had a problem with this camera, so don't think it's this camera just like we saw with the iPhone 2. The camera went crazy over in the area with uh, the supposed haunted dolls. It, oh, starting in that area, like, camera was just zooming in and out on its own, mm -hmm. unfocusing, and then the battery. the battery drained all the way down where it would go red and then go back up again. I've never had anything like that happen, even when My stuff was we're fine. on, <laughs> even when we're on paranormal investigation. So that was really weird. I mean, I can't say that place is haunted, but I think it's haunted. I would definitely love to do some type of overnight investigation there. Hopefully, maybe someday they'll offer something like that because that was crazy. But in any event, we're gonna get out of here. Again, if you want to see the video that we did here the last time, you can check one of the links up above. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for all of your likes, comments, and subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great day. See you guys.